guys so i'm coming back at you with another review video slash update um i am currently about a week into this camera since it got shipped and arrived officially arrived and sorry if you cannot hear me but we have the camera here still the same eos it is a crazy deal again i'll link um where i found the this specific I'll link the exact um, Amazon website um, that I got this from. And we can see that I have not needed to use this, but I'm glad they have a lot of these nice little fixtures. Yeah, I mean, these two I haven't used as much. Um, just because what I do is I just pop the um, like SD card into my computer at the computer slot. And I don't really use this, but this just seems like a lifesaver for that matter you know it's kind of a mess in here but i really enjoy it. i've only used the um 10 plus 10 it's nice you, you have little pockets in here and they say kind of close up and then you know what you know how close up so that would be not as close up and then this one is pretty close up i think it it's you know chronologically anyway um, so let's get into like how to use the camera at first. I mean, I was pretty confused I mean, you've got everything you need here Basically, if you want to just take a photo you just turn it on Like such you just rotate it clockwise and then you get this I actually edited the um, The screen colors and stuff so it looks kind of cool on the bottom right, right here, you can see how many photos I can take, and I think I think that's right. I think it's approximate. You can see your battery life. Um, you can see this button, which will get you to like continuous different modes. Yeah, continuous. Yep, yep. It's relatively easy. I mean, there's a lot of buttons you won't use. This is for video. And then, oh, this thing's off. So. It's, it's easy and like to screw on those separate little lenses here. I'll show you what they look like. Yeah, you just kind of screw it on. I mean, if you see here, um, if you see right there, you can kind of see it. Yeah, it, it fits just perfectly. I think it's very important to not scratch these up. So that's one thing I really recommend. Let's pop that shut. What else do we have? Let's have various SD cards. I think that's about it. Yeah, various SD cards of mine are right there. Booyah. Okay. And let's keep going with the review of the camera. So if I wanted to, for say, um, take a photo of, like, photo something in the dark, essentially what, what would be best to do is you'd lift this flap here. I don't know if I mentioned in my other review videos. You hold down that bad boy, and it kind of gets everything in focus by... Whoa, it looks so cool. Okay, let's... I don't know how cool this will... Ooh! So you can kind of see in here, there's different numbers at the bottom. And then it'll go like that. Boom. And then it'll show us a preview of the photo. Um, which the photo turned out to be super bright. I have to... <laughs> there we go. <laughs> super bright. We're going to delete it. All you do to delete is you just press that button when you're in that preview mode. Preview mode is here, so if you want to look at photos. I was confused at the beginning. So, boom, boom, boom. And then, <laughs> that's just a bad photo. But let me just show you some photos. I mean, my phone camera, my phone camera isn't that great right now, so I'll just show you a couple. But it's even better in person. These, this camera is great for 250 bucks. It's free shipping and on Amazon.com. And it's not even Black Friday. Anyway, just give me a second. I'm going to find some cool photos for you. We've got this one. It's pretty good. It was on the drive, but it looks so serene. It was this evening. That's Duluth tonight. They all look so good. Oh my gosh. Wow. All right. <laughs> We're going to check it on the big screen. Um, so, but just really quick before we go, guys. I don't want to make this video too long. Um, I've never actually used this. What does this do? Mm, you don't really know? Click it again. 
Huh. So it kind of gives you a little overview of the lighting or something. I don't know. See, some of these I don't even know. But anyway, um, so if we can go out of this display. Oh, so you just double click a bunch of times. Oh, so I think it shows like red, white, and blue balance. Wait, look. That's so neat. Look at that. Wow. All right. Anyway, let's go back. So to scroll between photos, all you do is press the right button if you want to go right and the left button if you want to go left. All right. Well, that wraps it up, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Please spread the word as I really do want to get my channel going a little bit just with a phone, you know, for now. Oh, and by the way, I actually have my own tripod. I will link the tripod in the description. It is only seven bucks and it's so big. It's not like luxurious, but it'll get you what you need. And um, yeah, seven bucks. I'll link you the website, free shipping, no tax. So camera works great on it. You know, it does what it needs to do. All right, that's all. Um, peace out, and we'll see you in the next video.